You've been burglarized, I think more than <laughs> once, twice, yes. and you yourself have confronted the burglar yes. and chased him off, is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, um, you know, one always thinks what one would do in a situation like that and... Oh, I uh, you know, know what I would do. <laughs> <laughs> I, would, I would just, I would get, I would just cr climb yes. into the disposal uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. of my sink. Yeah, I would just, a, a panic box, not yeah. even a panic room, just a box to hide in. Well, I get very angry. Because yeah. I think, you know, I work hard and I live with my girlfriend and, you know, heaven forbid I would not be there when something like this happened. So, yeah, I went out and, and confronted them a couple so what, times. So, okay, tell me, tell the, me first, the story of what happened. What happened the first time? The first time I had one of those very cheap um, garage doors, you know, like the one-piece kind of tin things. And it was 11 o'clock in the morning on a Tuesday and the guy just ripped it up, you know, bent the thing in half and was just casual as you like walking through my backyard looking for ways into my house and you know figuring out how he was going to rob me and I saw him and at this point I only had one weapon in my house uh, which was a baseball bat next to my bed yeah. and so I thought let's get the bat see what's see what's going to happen and so uh, I, I ran. <laughs> Let's see what's going to yeah. happen. And so, You're like a scientist. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Step into my lap. Yeah, yeah. And so I ran through the house and I grabbed the bat and I came out. I have French doors in my back uh, to the bedroom and I went out just as he was rounding the side of the house and he stopped and I looked at him and I said, "So we got business, mother." <laughs> so annoying. Yeah. Because it turns out we didn't have business, but he was not intimidated at all. He starts looking for his book. Right. No, I don't think so. <laughs> he just turned around and casual as you like, strolled out. I said, run! That's so amazing. So, so the next time it this, happened. I love this the next time. Well, By then. the way, where do you live? Where do you... <laughs> right this in is... Hollywood. I don't know what the heck. There's like zombies coming through the window. <laughs> so, the, so then I made it my business to arm myself. You had a baseball bat. That's pretty good. But yeah. you want to do? You want to take it up a notch? Well, I just, I just accumulated. You know, I'd be somewhere to swap me to something. I thought, oh, that would be good. And so, <laughs> like what? Like, like a mace? Yeah. yeah. I, I got a hatchet. I have a samurai sword. Nice. But I also have a machete. But it's kind of old and Mache rusted. Doesn't matter with a machete. It doesn't. It yeah. will still get the job done, yeah. right? You apologize Too well. first. I'm sorry well. about the shape my machete's in. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Have some of that. Yeah, yeah. You scoundrel. <laughs> yeah. Um, you had a machete. So I took, I, I, and unfortunately, I just have one weapon in each room. So uh, in this particular room <laughs> that I was in. Are they just in, like <laughs> hanging up everywhere? You can walk into any room and chushum. <laughs> You could be sitting on the toilet and <laughs> yeah. yeah, you gotta be prepared. That's my biggest fear, is to be broken into whilst in the shower. Because then you're wet, you're naked. It's not Just a keep a pool cue in there. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That might arouse suspicion. Yeah. <laughs> yes, that's true. Well, yes, well, yeah. we'll move on. Um, <laughs> so the second time, guy comes to the house, you've got the machete? Yeah, it was three o'clock in the morning and I was learning my lines and I had my cat on my knee. And we always hear, it. he's a little more skittish than I, I am. throw the cat. That's right? a good he, Let me tell you, he acts like he's tough. He was out of there. He kind of commandoed out and looked, and I, I could tell from his reaction that he really saw something, and he was gone. I mean, he looked back a little bit, was like, sorry, bro. But, <laughs> he, he got on his little motorcycle. Right. <laughs> it was a skateboard. But, um, but uh, yeah, and so I had the machete, and I stepped out, and there was this big guy there, and I was just thinking, God, I wish I had a bat, because you can't kind of friendly, you know, it's not a friendly maneuver you hitting someone. someone with a no. machete. It's and I was commitment. thinking if I turned it sideways, I could kind of spank him with it. <laughs> but <laughs> not like that, you know, it was a kind of, what hey. Not like what? He might, you know, <laughs> be like, oh, guy. one more time. You know? Right. <laughs> But, uh, but thankfully, he saw the machete and he, he said, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get out of here. I think the word is out. Do not mess with your house. Do not go near so. your apartment. Leave you alone.